All right, guys. Hey, how you doing? Good evening, man. We're at 9:30 p.m. of 21, 30, 100 hours. PR report. It's only been on for maybe, maybe five, maybe 10 minutes, and it's already just about at 150. I already locked everything down because I know the PR42 can get up the temp really fast. And so I got both my top vents. I want these at halfway because I want to run 200. I'm sorry, 190 to 210 throughout the whole night slow cook so this is a short few uh preview i got one vent halfway open and i'm gonna post a full video later on when i'm done so we're gonna lock this down halfway and i got that one on a quarter of a way open and i'm running with my meter plus tonight let's look at this pig all right here we go Bam, there we go. That's about 55 pounds once you take the head off, the feet off and everything. Okay, I got some real oak uh, lump running like 13, 12 pounds and two, two quarter splits of uh, hickory. Not running with a lot of wood. I got my pig rack on the bottom just in case I want to flip, but I'm gonna run skin side down throughout this whole cook. But if I want to flip, uh, I have another rack right here I just place on top lock it down with some 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 s hooks and then flip it by myself you guys seen the other videos that I did so I'm gonna take this off salt pepper garlic and I injected uh, the pig with some moho marinade man that stuff is some good stuff and so if you wonder where I got my rack from I got it from the uh, Laka Hachina China box if you ever if you ever use that that's an awesome pig roaster okay meter pro right there in the back and the butt we're going to close this up guys and i will see you in about six five to six hours and guess what i'm going to sleep all right guys hey good morning it is where we at 358 i started up started at about 9 30 so when i set this thing I said I wanted to run between 180 and 2, 210, 215. Rock solid for about six hours, seven hours, six hours and 30 minutes. So I had my pit set halfway, uh, a little bit less than a quarter, a little bit more than a quarter. And right over here, I uh, did have to adjust a little bit, halfway open, and then uh, had that one half and a, and a quarter right there okay let's check out the pig let's check it out so i've been skin side down for six hours oh that looks delicious look at this thing all the good juice fantastic let's check this nub nah yep it's getting there skin starting to pull away here, let's see. There we go. There's the oh, I gotta get me a taste right there. So I injected this with some moho sauce. Oh, that comes off pretty good. That's good. Mm. Nice and smoking. Still got a piece of wood in there. I got plenty of, of fuel. Mm -mm -mm. God, that's good. Let's lift up this. Uh, this bottom right here from my pig rack so it did shrink down a little bit let's see let's take it oh lose my juice oh look at that that looks good so when it's time to uh uh give me some crackling i'm gonna take my diverter plate off and then spread the coals out just a little bit more and start crisping this skin up oh let's check these rib bones Almost. Okay, it's there. But well, we're gonna let this keep it going. I'm gonna poke some holes in here, not to pierce the skin, but get that juice back down in the meat. No spraying, guys. I let this thing rock and roll for six hours, six, six hours and thirty minutes. Almost. Okay, we're gonna bump this temperature up just a little bit, probably about to two thirty, and then we're gonna be finished. All right, guys, hey, that's a wrap on my cook. We just about finished. I'm going to go ahead and pull it. There's the bacon 
Ooh, look at that bacon right there, just coming straight out. All the good juice down there with the mojo. This right here, I'm going to slice uh, really thin, what we call uh, sliced pork. But the bacon and the ribs are done. All that green mojo stuff in there, that green mojo sauce, that's what it is. All right, guys, I got to get to shredding this up. Hey, blessings to you. We'll talk to you later.